So, I see you've received the free ticket I sent you. I'm glad. I did so want you to be here. You see, it doesn't matter if you catch me and send me back to the asylum. Gordon's been driven mad. I've proved my point. I've demonstrated there's no difference between me and everyone else. All it takes is one bad day to reduce the sanest man alive to lunacy. That's how far the world is from where I am. Just one bad day. You had a bad day once, am I right? I know I am. Yeah, I can tell. You had a bad day and everything changed. <laughs> Why else would you dress up as a flying rat? You had a bad day and it drove you as crazy as everybody else. Only you won't admit it. You have to keep pretending that life makes sense, that there's some point to all this struggling. God, you make me want to puke. I mean, what is it with you? What made you what you are? Girlfriend killed by the mob, maybe? Or like carved up by some mugger? Something like that, I bet. Something like that. Something like that happened to me, you know. I... I'm not exactly sure what it was. Sometimes I remember it one way, and sometimes I remember another. If I'm going to have a past, I prefer it to be multiple choice. <laughs> but my point is, my point is, I went crazy. When I saw what a black, awful joke the world was, I went as crazy as a coot. I admit it. Why can't you? I mean, you're not unintelligent. You must see the reality of the situation. Do you know how many times we've come this close to World War Three over, over a flock of geese on a computer screen? Don't trigger the last World War. An argument over how many telegraph poles Germany owed its war debtors. Telegraph poles. <laughs> Everything anybody ever valued or struggled for, it's all a monstrous, demented gag. So, why can't you see the funny side? Why aren't you laughing?